What has happened? Hold on. Hold on. The bus is upside down on fire. How did that happen? I don't... I... Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks video. Today we've got something quite interesting to show you guys, and it is this thing right here. Now, you might notice that it is actually running, but it isn't moving, uh, and the reason is because I'm stood over here. Yes. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Meow. Um, yeah, it, I don't really know what it's doing, but I, I, I think it'll end up in there. I, I'm... I'm pretty sure, <laughs> but I don't really know. Wait, is it gonna? Is it gonna? I think it'll stop in here. So let's have a little look. Come on, come on, in you go. Yes. All right, be oh, beautiful. Look at that. That is awesome. Okay, so yeah, this is called the self-driving autonomous bus, and it's just drove off. It has actually just drove. Oh, okay. Right, well, this um, automatically drives you from O'Neill Air Base to the port, and then it comes back, I'm pretty sure. So, we're gonna just spawn in another one, it'll do probably exactly the same thing, uh, and then it'll get driving again. So, here we go, let's go ahead and open this, self-driving bus, off it goes, Now, yeah, there we go, that is awesome. Uh, so this was actually built by a guy called I Love Yogurt, and um, yeah, it seems quite cool. All right, come on in. Come on, I'm waiting. It says wait here, so we are waiting right here. And then it'll pull in, the door will open, we'll get inside, and we just have to sit in one of the back seats. All right, this makes sense. We'll sit here. All right, beautiful, and we're off. <laughs> oh, this is so weird, but I like it. All right, okay, so we should uh, actually probably um, catch up with the other one, uh, and then we should have two buses running. I mean, that sound. Wait, does it stop at this place too? I wonder if it does multiple stops. That would be cool. Alright, let's have a little look here. Are we gonna stop here too? I think we are. Yeah, we are. Look at that. Awesome. I mean, this bus service seems a little bit better than my, like, bus service in real life. Not that I've been on a bus in years, but still. Uh oh, it closes. It closes very quickly, and then it just automatically drives off again. Uh, so if you do jump off there, you're gonna have issues. Um, but we should be behind the other bus that we sent, probably. I don't know whether they come back down the same road either, so if we've got two buses coming forwards and backwards uh, down the same path, then obviously we're going to have a few issues, but um, yeah. Oh, dude, this is awesome. Because there isn't like there isn't really any way to get from uh, that airbase to this place um, like quickly, and also it just isn't on the map when you spot. It is. Look, it's still driving. It's already here. Oh, we, well, we're not going to be able to catch it, but, I mean, that's still pretty cool. Oh, and I suppose I should mention, uh, you have to actually start a mission to do this. Uh, you have to, um, like, load it up in the mission editor, and then you have to put all the pieces in so it spawns them, uh, and then you have to set an objective, and then it spawns in. So, it's a little bit tricky to actually do if you have I've never messed with the mission editor before. Um, but, you know... You guys should be able to do it. Alright, so the first bus is presumably there. I mean, it stopped, so that's a good thing. Uh, hopefully we can get round and past it by the time it starts coming back. I don't know whether it automatically comes back. There it is, right there. We can just about see it. <gasps> it's on its way. Uh-oh, we're about to have an autonomous bush crash. Bush? I can't speak. Oh, they dodge each other! Oh, that is awesome! Look at that! One drives on one side and one drives on the other. That's so cool! We've got an automatic bus service. Look at it go! Meow. So that one's gone back down there. We didn't crash into each other. I don't know whether that's like an automated path or it's got some sort of object, um, like, d d diversion stuff. So you actually move out the way of it. I don't know. Um, but now that we're actually here on the coast, oh, that is awesome. Like, I didn't expect it to work so well, but it has. Can we get in the front? I want to try and get in the front and go back to the airport. So if this door opens, yes. All right, run round. Da -da 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 -da. Open the door. Get inside. Uh, close the door. Beautiful. Can we turn off the automatic stuff? I don't think I can. No, but it's got like it's. Um, oh, we got lights in here too. Cabin lights. That doesn't seem to work. 
Oh, that is that is cool. What's this? Manual drive. Oh, here we go. So we can actually just drive this by ourselves <laughs> if we want to. Oh, this is super cool. All right, let's go for a proper drive then. All right, let's go ahead and try and follow this road uh, for a little while. I don't know what happens if I turn manual drive off. Also, the indicators come on when I press left or right. Look at that. That is pretty awesome. All right. Whoa, okay. Oh, yeah, this is why you don't put me in charge of a bus. Ever. Never let me drive. <laughs> Rip. All uh, right, can I actually get out? I can't. No, I can't get out. Hold on. Open the door. There we go. Oh, yeah. Perfect. So, yeah. Don't let me drive buses, but um, the automated version of this bus works a lot better than the Maddie driven version of this bus. But there you go. Oh, I accidentally spawned it in again, but um, yeah. Let's see what happens here, because one of them is going to come in from that side, and one of them is going to come in from this side, presumably. No, actually. I wonder if that one loops all the way around. It probably does, right? I'd imagine it does. Oh, that is so, so cool. Look at it. Meow, drift bus. I mean, they don't go slow, do they? They really don't go slow. And then it, it should, like, come around. And then stop. Yeah. Wow. So just in case I haven't mentioned already, uh, I Love Yogurt actually built this thing. And it is super, super cool. I don't know. I mean, it's less laggy than having, like, a rail all the way there. So, um, yeah, this is actually really awesome. Look at it go. Meow. Uh, right, well, I think we're going to test out a plane now. Alright, so my um, my workshop is a little bit broken right now, but we do have a helicopter that we can test out, so let's go ahead and load it up. Here we go. Recon. So it's the side CH-15 Recon Helicopter. Let's go ahead and grab it. There we go. Uh, this was built by Rowan, and uh, he usually builds pretty good stuff. Uh, and if you guys want to actually attach rockets or whatever to this thing, um, you can. Uh, side. I think they're called side. Yeah, look. Here we go. Side. Yes. Beautiful. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and get inside real quick. Haha, <laughs> get it inside. Beautiful. Um, right, master arm. I don't know. Yeah, okay. Uh, so up here we've got a heater. Okay. I probably shouldn't have turned that on first, but whatever. Channel up, channel down, talk. We don't need those. Auto hover, fuel pump. Yep, starter. Monitors, gyro. Um, let's turn that off. Radar, okay. Interior lights, nav lights, yes. All right, that's it. That's all of them. Do this. And we should be able to start moving. Awesome. Dude, doesn't this look good? I think this looks epic, actually. Okay, so let's try and race one of those buses to the uh, to the, to the destination. We can fly just all the way over there. Do we have autopilot in this? We have... No. No, we don't have any autopilot, but that's okay. Just keep going. This is fine. All right, how far away are they? They're already there? They already got there. Those things are quick. I have a little bit of an idea. Uh, maybe what we could do is we could spawn in some sort of like tsunami. Um, and we'll see how the buses act once they've been hit by it. So uh, we'll put the wind on full first. And we'll have a little like look around, see where the bus... I see one. I see one. It's right there. On its way back. Yeah. All right. Is that the front one or the back one? Have they crashed? No, they're both coming. They're both on their way back over. Oh, yes. All right, okay. So, I think they might actually be faster than this helicopter. I'm not going to lie. I think they might be quicker than me in this. That's a bit crazy, actually. Uh, but here they come. They're on full wind. So, um, you know, we'll see if the wind knocks them over. I don't think it does. And they're driving completely fine. Look at it go. Yeah, it is. It's driving completely fine. That's insane. Wait, can we get in the back? Is there a way to get... Is there a way for us to get in the back of this thing? I don't think there is. Alright. Oh, wait. Maybe. Maybe. Oh. Wait, what's that? Oh, I'm falling. No, that's good. That's a good. What's this? Hatch. Auto disconnect jet fuel only. No. No, let me get back inside. Ugh. Okay, right. That's fine. That's... No, I can't. I can't press the button. There we go. Okay, Tsunami is uh, over there. We're going to go... Oh, one of them's about to hit it. Get over there, quickly. Okay, so I don't know what I can do in the back of this thing, but we do have winches on the sides. So we must be able to deal with those somehow. 
That's our camera control. Okay. Uh, winch. Oh, I don't know. Maybe we can get in the winch? I'm confused. Anyway, uh, the buses have disappeared into a tsunami. Okay. So, that should mean that they've either broken, stopped, or just been thrown to a different, like, location? Uh, well, let's have a little look, see where they are. Alright, one's on the road. Wait, th that one's automatically started straight back up. The other one is right there, it's backwards. Okay, right, this is going to be interesting to see what happens. Okay, so it, it's, like, reversed. I It seems to have broken it at least a little bit. Oh, it might have broken the engine. Yeah, I think it has. It's broken the vehicle too much. Otherwise, it would just restart and drive away again. Wow. Yo, those things are really cool. Can we move over? Let's see if we can manually do it. I think it is just broken, though. All right, out we go. There we go. Jump inside of this thing. Oh, it's the seat that's broken, too. Yeah, that's not good. That's not good. Open the door. Manual drive. I mean, that's not going to help me, but no, it's it's definitely broken. Oh, well, that's upsetting spaghetti. But they can, they can survive the tsunami sometimes. So, I mean, that's at least a uh, saving grace. They've been built extremely well, though. Like, it would be kind of cool if we had, um, I don't know, like a, a selector in there, and we could select a few different paths to drive down. Um, I, I There must have been a lot of work gone into this, so I'm not going to say um, that would be easy to do. Um, but that would be awesome. We could just, like, turn up at any airport and be like, Alright, take me to the next airport, or take me to the fishing village. What has happened? Hold on! Hold on! The bus is upside down on fire! Well, how did that happen? I don't, I... Okay, well, we've had a few issues with these, these buses. Um, and this is, this is one of them. Yeah, I don't really know what's going on there, but... That's obviously bad. <laughs> Um, I, how has this happened? It's fully upside down. That's a bit mental. All right, okay. Uh, yeah, we got harness. I don't know what that does. Can we just, I don't, I, yeah, I don't, I don't get it. But anyway, uh, I think I'm going to end this video here so that you guys can check out these things for yourselves because, yeah, you can. It's got flares as well, just in case you wanted to use them. Um, but yeah, bus service, I'm going to go with quite reliable, except from when you smack it with a tsunami, or when you drive it yourself. Uh, helicopter, very reliable, this thing flies quite nicely. Um, if it had a little bit of an autopilot, that'd be cool, but um, I don't think it does. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys for watching. If you guys want to check out either of these things, I'll link them both down below, and you guys can check them out for yourselves. Uh, but thank you for watching, hope you guys enjoyed it, see you in the next one, goodbye.